Do you put God first? Or you just want to comfort yourself saying, oh, what I'm doing is not wrong because I'm a Christian. Oh no, my friends, don't use that banner of Christianity because this is a brand with many affiliates. The Bible says, God says, that is looking for those who will worship him in the spirit and in truth. Are you one of them? That bread of life that you have, you are literally borrowing it from Jesus Christ. This is the reality, my friends. And this is how much Jesus Christ loves you. Amen. The Bible says in 2 Peter chapter 3, verse 9, that God did not delay when it comes to his promise, which means that he will soon return and that he gives eternal life to those who call upon his name. That he wants all men, absolutely all men, to come to repentance. Why repentance? Because this world is corrupted. By what? By sin. And this is the reason why we have been separated from God. Because of sin. And this is why you see all these abominations happening around us in the world. Because of sin. Because when Satan, the enemy, the one who is working literally, who is working literally against you, he's trying one way or another to put you down. He's trying one way or another to literally take out of your life everything that God wants to give you. Amen. Preach. And it's also when it comes to eternal life. Yes, my friends, this is not by works, but by faith, by believing in God that we have eternal life, that literally we can be set free from all sin, that literally we can be set free from all bondage. Oh, my. There are things that you may not be aware of, my friends, but maybe you are struggling with something, with addiction. Maybe you are struggling with something that is bigger than you, but you know what? Jesus Christ is bigger than anything else in this world. And this is why God, our Heavenly Father, has given him the name that is above all names. For every knee shall bow and every tongue shall confess that Jesus Christ is his Lord. Lord. <laughs> Hallelujah. Uh, yes, my friends. Because we live in the world, a world that is corrupted, my friends. Yes, you are passing by. You are hearing that message. And this is great. Because God is with us. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. He's everywhere. He wants you. He's calling you. And I know that you can hear that message. I know that you are receiving that message. Why? Because God lives in you. But what it needs to do with you is to renew your spirit. To renew your spirit is literally to let God in. To let him in. So that he can correct everything that is not right. So that he can correct everything that you may be lacking right now. To refresh you, to renew you. To make you like having that rebirth that you need to come to the Lord. But yes, my friends, literally, God is with us, and He loves us, and He cares for us. And this is why we are here today to witness how great He is, how merciful, how gracious He is. Because yes, my friends, we were born into sin. But because of His blood, we are literally cleansed from all unrighteousness. We are literally, my friends, made brand new by the power of his blood. This is how powerful Jesus Christ is, my friends. So he's calling each and every one of you once again. All of you who may be tired by this long day at work. All of you who may be stressed out because you have some work to deliver and maybe you cannot keep that delay, that time frame that you have. But guess what? 
You don't need to take pills. You don't need to take all these things because Jesus Christ, if you call upon his name, he shall answer. Yes. This is how faithful Jesus Christ is. You need to get arrested. This is why he loves you. Jesus Christ loves you, my friend. And I forgive you. <laughs> Hallelujah. Because this message literally is being heard. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. God bless you. God, God bless, bless you, you, sir. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise the Lord. So again, my friends, Jesus Christ didn't come to judge you, but to save you. Because many of you are hurting. Even if you may be just pretending right now. You may be like, oh, I'll be fine. Tomorrow is another day. But you know what? Tomorrow is not yours. You may never get up anymore. You may never wake up anymore. I know it sounds scary, but this is the reality. And we have to face that reality, my friends. We have to face that reality. That if we do not accept Jesus Christ today, what will come? Is there hope outside of Jesus Christ? Can you answer that, answer that question? What was the question? There is no hope. There is no life without Jesus Christ. Because he is the savior of this world. He is the one who can heal you from all sin. He can heal you from all sickness, from all disease. Yes, the same way he healed me myself. Hallelujah. I was in sin myself, my friends. I was. Yes, I not all the time did things right. But you know what? Because I trusted in the Lord. Because I have literally surrendered all to him. That he saved me. He gave me another chance. And this is why I'm here today to witness that Jesus Christ is alive. Jesus Christ is literally the life. He is the way. He is the truth. And no one comes to the Father except through him. For there Amen. is no other name by whom we can, you can have salvation. Ooh. No other name. No other name than the name of Jesus Christ. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. So I'm sure, my friends, that before getting, going to bed tonight, you will literally remember that message. And you'll be thinking, what if I accept Jesus Christ today? Bring him what in. if Bring him in. I surrender all to him today? It's got to be a new life, a rebirth, and everything will literally We're going change right now, for babe. the better. We're going right now. Hallelujah. We're uh, preaching. Keep your eye on the radio. So, my friends, today, this is a calling. If you can hear the voice of Jesus Christ calling you right now, please do not harden your heart. Do not harden your heart because he loves you and he cares for you. And this is why he sent us here to share his love, to show you that he is real. Yes, my friends, we are here with the speaker, with the microphone. Babe, this is not because we don't have anything to do. Right no, it's because the love of Christ that is within us, we share it with you. To love our neighbor as we love ourselves is to speak the truth even when it hurts. Because speaking the truth can literally set you free from all your bondage, my friends. God bless you. Speaking the truth, God bless you. Wanna, uh, you want a flyer? All right, speaking hold on. the truth, my friends, can right, set you out. free. Give you maybe one, some my, uh, of you are suicidal. Maybe some of you may be hurting inside. Maybe guys, some of you may you be stressed out. Maybe some of you may be sick. Website. Praise the Lord. Well, which is you guys from? But my friends, I'm telling you, there is power in the name of Jesus. Amen. God bless you, sir. There is power in the name of Jesus. He has the power to heal you from um, all sickness. Hey man, the Lord the has Lord, brought sister. us out of the churches. He has the to power honest, literally to lift you up when you feel like, like giving up. Everything's on the website. Yes, my Just friends. Look at Facebook and this is the message today. God bless you, man. you don't have to live down watch? anymore. Huh? Lift watch? up your voice. Lift up your hand. Hey, if you want. And yeah. walk with the love of God. It's the bread of life. Hallelujah. 
My friends, Jesus Christ is calling you. Jesus Christ is calling each and every one of you right now. I already got one yesterday. Oh, You'll see. So if you can hear his voice, music. please wow. I get come, to all the time. We, we come to us. Come to us. We can pray together. Down there, we got yelled at. We can pray. We are family, there, my uh, friends. We are family. We are one there. in Christ. Wow. Come to us. Come so, uh, so that we can pray for you. Whatever your troubles may be, whatever, Lord, uh, my friends. That's how we know. You may be going through right now. Come to us. Come. We are family, and we will pray together. We will sort things out because there is nothing that Jesus Christ cannot do. If we ever want to like, hook there up is with us, nothing we'll streets, that Jesus Christ cannot do. do. Come, come, hit me up. I was gonna, I, we I, are I humans. Those, I was gonna start with my friend. But we can have breakdowns. Let's all get together then. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Jesus Christ is, literally uh -huh, so can do uh, all uh, things. I just recently got two days off, so I can start. Because you know what, my friends. Okay. Without right. him, we can what do nothing. Was the fact that we have, he know, says himself, the over there. They I right am now. the vine, they're, they're you are the branches. So, okay, they hate if us. you abide in me, <laughs> and I abide in you, they call the police, you right? will bear many I, fruits. I you because I want because to without me, you can oh, no, do no, no, nothing. No, no, no. no yes, here. my friends. Without Jesus uh, Christ, God. we cannot get up. We cannot wake up in the morning. That's, that's Without the, that's Jesus Christ, name, one witness, we meaning, cannot have that bread of life that we are we breathing right now. Christ, but we're not your witness. We no that, Jesus Christ, we, we, we can guy, have uh, the family. The we can that's, have that's David. all these David things Lynn, yeah. that we're chasing. But my friend, let me tell you this. this. These things that you are chasing right now, all material things, Life all these right things right that now. you are longing for, do you think that literally they will save you from this corrupted world? Do you think that they will save you from the, that, the judgment thing that is coming? We live in the end of times, my friends, and we need to wake up. This is a wake up call. I'm, the Lord put me down here. This is a wake up call, my friends. Days. I've done seven days so far. It's my we need day. to come and to Jesus here, Christ. You need, my friends, Everywhere to come to Jesus city, Christ. Wow. They've been kicking me out. Because They're Jesus city, Christ man. is love. Square, Jesus Lee Christ square, is the Columbus Savior circle, and the light of this world. There, and you are a part of his plan. Wants he to wants to save you. He wants to set you free they from this corrupted they, world they that we live in. The, uh, amplifier, the, yeah. Oh, wow. That's the main yes, reason. my friend. So you take the amplifier and we, you know, yeah. I'm going to yell. But Jesus not, Christ not wants you so bad. Especially when you hurt. You are hurt. When we get to court. Jesus Christ literally wants you. Uh, he wants to help you. It's like a, it's he wants to have that fellowship with you. Even if you don't voice. believe in him. Even if you the don't want to hear of thing. him. So, he wants you, my friends. But I know a guy in the police force anyway. So. He wants you. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. God bless you. <laughs> Amen. See, they're here. Children of Hallelujah. Here. Praise the Lord. For the Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 I feel like worshiping right now. I feel like worshiping right now. There is power in the name of Jesus. Yes, my friends. There Amen. is power in the name of Jesus. I didn't know you could sing. There is power in the name of Jesus. To break every chain, break every chain, break every chain. Yes, it can break your chains, my friends. To break every chain. We, we need more people out here, chain, man. Because yeah. it started with me. I was Hallelujah. the only street preacher in Jefferson. And then other people started coming the along name with me. Jesus. So the Lord set me out to do this. There is and I believe that we all come together to do this. I used to evangelize with the way I used to do it was I, I used to go to a person to person. There is power oh, okay. in the parts in the name like of Jesus. Wait until you see the YouTube videos. I, I took right. a beating. I took a beating. I know. To break all your chains. Man, to break Some all real demonic forces chains. out here. To break all your chains. Greater to break than us than he is who in the world. To break all you your chains. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Yes, my friends. This is the message today for you. This is the message for you, my friends. Jesus Christ can break all of your chains. And all you have to do is just to open up your heart to him, to let him in. 
so that it can restore you, so that it can heal you, it's mostly like so that it can save you, my friends. Yeah, yes. Was, uh, and we are here witnessing his love. We came out of love right now to talk to name? you. William, William Jokas. Is it because yeah. we do not have anything to do? I've seen a no. lot of street just get hit. Oh, yeah. But we the love you. Is uh, get and Jesus Hot Christ loves you even more. Yes, so my friends. Things. Let me just man, man, so we see this blessing with a bullhorn. Right we see that Columbus it. Circle, man. Even there's, actually, maybe, there's actually a law you for may the be amplifier. Thinking, yeah, you can have it at I've a certain level. So many yeah, they, they, the guy didn't get a ticket. He didn't give a decibel Jesus meter. Christ he didn't, he didn't take it out. So I know I'm gonna get that ticket done. I've not. I've yeah, done needs, so many he's, things. He's a decibel meter. He needs a. Because you can't go by him in here. He cannot. So it has to. He cannot save me. No, uh -huh. my friends. So this is a lie of Satan. That, this is a lie of the enemy. Because, because he doesn't it. want <laughs> you to come to Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> because he doesn't want you to have a relationship with Jesus Christ. This is freedom of speech right here. Exactly. There is nothing that Jesus nobody Christ really cannot forgive. Nobody really does that. and nobody really does it. I'm telling you, Nothing, people, my friends. We're here to pray for you. We're here to show you love. But they reject it. It's literally to open up your heart, my friends, to Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Praise the leave. Lord. Praise the Lord. God bless you, ma'am. God ma bless you. Sister. You want a flyer? Hallelujah. God bless you. Okay, God Hallelujah. bless you. Thank you. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. He's alive yeah. indeed. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. We lift up his name today because again, he's there. Jesus Christ is among us. We He's need, calling need, each and every one of you right here. now, my friends. <laughs> well, as you're as hearing as this as message, literally, literally, I decree and declare God the name of Jesus me. Christ. Come, that man, you come. Are from the any disease, from you feel any the Holy Spirit sickness, in you right now? Yeah. From you want to use that mic? No, no, no. Okay. All right, you feel You are healed right now in the name of Jesus Christ. And this is the message today, my friends. Whoever you are, 